The local individual release of this trio was widely anticipated, especially LG's offering. As the prices go up, the cameras are, well, expected to go along that upward trend. What's up Manila? This is Caesar for Manila Shaker with a 3-way camera comparison between the OnePlus 5G, Huawei Mate 10 Pro, and LG V30+. Plus. First things first, all shots are taken in their respective auto modes to gauge their respective software as well. With that out of the way, let us move into the first shot. In this close-up, the OnePlus 5G without any doubt had the grainiest shot with poor exposure compensation too. The Mate 10 Pro comes next in line with better detailing and still accurate colors. However, if it was just going to be about details, the V30 Plus wins in that regard but with poor automatic white balancing. Turning bokeh on, the difference in the OnePlus 5T shot is as clear as day with acceptable subject selection. The Mate 10 Pro adjusted harshly that resulted to having worse exposure than the OnePlus 5T's and indiscernible bokeh. While the V30 Plus may not have such, it offers its secondary wide-angle lens for capturing more but with less details. Next is a landscape shot in the middle of the night, and the story is about the same. The OnePlus 5T ranks the lowest in exposure values and details. The Mate 10 Pro and V30 Plus are at a tie when it comes to details but the more vibrant colors of the V30 Plus puts it at the top. Following that nighttime shot is an indoor shot of our studio with a focus supposedly on our main camera which the OnePlus 5T did a poor job of picking up. On the bright side, the camera is lit all well and good, but when compared to the other two, it shows the lack of contrast that it presents. On the Mate 10 Pro and V30 Plus, details are near identical. The V30 Plus has a wider aperture in the shot and more prominent reds too. Next is a daylight landscape shot. Details are virtually the same for all three. What set them apart are the colors, especially the difference in white balance. The V30 Plus, once again, goes for a flatter and colder tone as seen in the background in the sky. The blue U on the windows on the building in front too are also varying between the three with the Mate 10 Pros being the lightest in that regard. Now, with an HDR shot, the Mate 10 Pro takes the lead by having the most range without sacrificing colors. The OnePlus 5T comes next and the V30 Plus ends up last for having the worst detail in the darkest area over the right. However, after all has been said and done, the V30 Plus shoots itself up with better colors than the two. With the last of the rear camera shots, the V30 Plus tries to stay neutral again with its white balance that shows lighter blues. However, the colors are correctly captured by OnePlus 5T and Huawei Mate 10 Pro. Before getting into the video test, let's have a check of their front cameras first. First up is a low light shot that all three captured beautifully. The OnePlus 5T did well in the way of balancing detailing and shutter speed. What the Mate 10 Pro lacked in detail made up with its better exposure levels, colors, and bokeh. While the V30 Plus's attempt is admirable, the blown up and soft details on the subject's face only shows that it had a hard time taking this picture. Next, with the light on. It ended up being almost the same case as earlier. Details, again, are the sharpest on the OnePlus 5T with wonderful color capture. With sufficient lighting, the Mate 10 Pro was able to show its prowess in detailing with outstanding subject selection for bokeh. However, as good as the two looks, the V30 Plus lagged with its still blurry shot despite having an overhead light. And down to the last of the camera samples, here's where the V30 Plus comes back up with equally sharp details and more vibrant colors that are evident in the skin tone at the top. With the video sample, the V30 Plus comes out on top with 4K capabilities and with stabilization on. It is also worth mentioning that it can shoot in Cinelog format, which provides the flattest of colors on a smartphone for videographers. The Mate 10 Pro pales in comparison since its stabilization can only be used for up to 1080p at 30fps. The OnePlus 5T did not outshine anyone, but for its price, the image quality that it gives is more than convincing. While the OnePlus 5T may not have given Huawei and LG a run for their money, its cameras are well within the range of acceptable difference when it comes to flagship spec smartphones. However, for general photography, the Mate 10 Pro is what I would recommend and if you like shooting videos on your phone, the V30 Plus is still the top choice for this year. So, what is your pick for this 3-way comparison? Is it the OnePlus 5T, Huawei Mate 10 Pro, or the LG V30 Plus? Let us know in the comments below and we will see you in the next one. Till then.